Hi, I'm Andrew and welcome to Cruise Masterclass. Today we're going to be looking at electric brakes and how to adjust them. You'll find electric drum brakes in one form or another on most caravan and camper trailers. Pretty basic design and they've been around for a while. You can get them from a few different manufacturers. These particular ones are our Cruise Master all-terrain electric brakes. We've been testing these and developing these for a few years and they're great in all conditions. Now, when we're talking about adjusting electric brakes, we're talking about adjusting the shoes. As the shoes bed in when you first get them or as they wear during use, we need to be adjusting the shoes out to make sure we have the right clearance between the shoe and the drum to make sure we always have effective braking. Now, to do that adjustment, you need a few basic tools. When we're doing our brake adjustment, we need to get the tire off the ground. So we need to jack it up with either a bottle jack or a trolley jack. Then we need to secure the vehicle so it doesn't fall on us using a jack stand or axle stand. To actually do the adjustment on the brakes, you need a brake adjustment tool. You can get a proper one from um, any of the auto stores. You can make one out of a piece of steel like we do here at our Tone Performance Center, or in a pinch, you can use a flat bladed screwdriver. When we're doing the adjustment, we pop the little plug out the back. Um, it's a bit easier to do here without the drum on, but you can get it out with the screwdriver if you need to. The tool here goes in the slot in the back of the brake, and we are turning this star wheel on the adjuster here. So one way um, you turn the adjuster, it makes this adjuster mechanism get longer, the other way it gets shorter. So as we get longer, we're pushing the shoes out. As we're getting shorter, we're bringing them in. So pretty straightforward from that point of view. We're going to get under the trailer now and show you it actually done practically and hopefully it all makes sense. All right, so it's nice and easy on the bench. Now we're under the trailer and we're gonna do it properly. So we've jacked it up um, on Cruise Master suspensions. We always have a place where you can safely jack the arm up from. You can see here, you can put a bottle jack inside there and it won't fall out. Um, to secure it, we've got an axle stand here underneath the chassis and the tire is now free to move. The first step is we're gonna adjust it so that the shoes come out and contact the drum. And we do that by rotating the wheel inside the hole here. So that's kind of a, you know, a, a movement where you're going from the outside of the drum towards the center of the axle. So we'll do that a few times whilst we're moving the wheel. And eventually it's beginning to bind there. There we go, that's solid. So that's the shoes out to the drum. Now, this is the tricky bit. We have to then reverse that back about eight to 10 clicks. So we go the opposite way, so axle to drum. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. So wheel's now freely moving again. Not really any dragging there. And that's it. If it needs the bung put him back in, chuck it back in, and then safely remove it off the axle stands. There you have it. You can see that adjusting electric brakes is a pretty easy process. I did want to mention that whilst we've found that eight to 10 clicks on most electric brakes on the market will get you in the right place for your adjustment, before you hook into it, make sure if you're not using a Cruise Master brake, you consult your owner's manual or the manufacturer before you start. There are other parts in an electric brake which can wear and that may need to be replaced. That's things like the shoes and the magnets. If you're giving it a particularly hard time, you might need to replace the whole brake. So at Cruise Master, you can give us a call or hop onto our website and you'll see that we have got spare parts, magnet shoes for our own brakes, and we've got similar spare parts for the other major brands on the market. To make sure that you don't miss any more of the Cruise Masterclass videos, make sure you get onto YouTube, Instagram, or Facebook and check them out.